The West Indies have got off the mark at the ICC World 2020 in a rather bizarre but one-sided game against Bangladesh. They won by 73 runs, despite never really getting into their best form with the bat, but they were quickly able to silence the passionate home crowd. Invited to bat, they reached 171 for six. Dwayne Smith hit 72, and a clearly far from fully fit Chris Gale made a run of all 48. Bangladesh were dreadful in the field until the very final overs, when Dwayne Bravo, Andre Russell and Dennis Ramdin all fell for golden ducks. Four wickets fell in the 20th over, three of them to Al Amin Hossein, as Bangladesh fought back, but they'd already let the West Indies get too many runs on the board. Animal Huck and Tammy Mikbal cracked early boundaries before the West Indies struck to reduce them to 16 for three, those three wickets coming in five balls. A brief Bangladesh fight back led by Mushfika Rahim was soon suppressed, and where Bangladesh had been awful in the field, the West Indies, two slip-ups from Marlon Samuels aside, were outstanding, Bravo and Sammy holding on to super catches to hasten the home side's demise. Their innings rather petered out to a desperately disappointing 98 all-out. Elsewhere today in the women's competition, Ireland made their debut but were no match for New Zealand, who made it two wins in two by defeating the newcomers by 42 runs. Susie Bates and Frances Mackay scored half centuries. Reigning champions Australia were pushed all the way by South Africa before winning by six wickets. A vital unbeaten 41 from Ellis Perry helped them reach a target of 116 with eight balls to spare. Tomorrow is a rest day in the men's competition before South Africa play the Netherlands and England meet Sri Lanka on Thursday, a game which surely must give us more of a contest than the last two we've seen.